Well, Dave, you've already uh, faced your toughest opponent here this week uh, in your grandmother, 92, five foot one in the airport. How tough was that? Yeah, no, well, it was incredible to see her. Uh, but yeah, it was uh, it was tough, <laughs> tough leaving her there. To be fair, she grabbed hold of my hand, and yeah, it wasn't any letting go. But no, it's awesome to awesome to see her. In a few days' time, you're going to be running out at Loftus Rares belt behind you, though. Um, for you, I'd imagine real goosebump moment. It's, it's special coming home to Africa. Yeah, no, it's it's awesome to be back uh, back home here, and I think most most schoolboys growing up here in, in Zimbabwe and South could dream dream of playing across the road there. So no, it's going to be a very special moment for me, and um, yeah, one I'm very excited for. Rob just talked about tour rules; it's like a little mini camp and everything. But boys are really relaxed, and really enjoying the whole experience. It's something different. Yeah, no, I think I think to be fair, most of the boys in this group of boys thrive thrive with change and and. No, it's been it's been an awesome couple of days so far already. So yeah, it's really looking forward to the rest of the week. You've had a great start in the Heineken so far, two from two. But if you can get a result on Saturday night across the road, there it really put you in a great position. Yeah, it would be massive. It'd be massive for us. And yeah, just in terms of the the whole seeding and stuff, if if we can pick up an away win, obviously we we did an awesome job to get that away at cast, and if we can. It'll be it'll be massive for us going forward. In terms of it, though, the form is good. You know, you come in on the back of a great result against Northampton last weekend. There's a real buzz around training. I think boys are, are relishing this whole opportunity. Yeah, no, no, it's been good. It's been good. We we obviously didn't put in, in a good performance against Harrys and got got punished for that. Awesome team, but we, I think we showed we we responded well last week to, to and put up a good performance against Saints. You see the glow on your face. It's hot out here at the moment. It's a bit yeah. of a accident at the moment. No, uh, yeah, I've already caught the sun. Just from a playing perspective, just tell us a little bit how having to adapt to conditions over here and that if we're seeing balls flying through the air a lot faster and higher. Yeah, it is. It is different. Um, yeah, the boys are enjoying it. Obviously, last week, like playing in the rain and the wind, and then coming out here is above 30 degrees. So. It's gonna, it's gonna take. It will be a test for us to, to adjust that quickly. But I think one, one we're looking forward to. Jake White said after the game at Sandy Park, we'll see a different balls. What kind of balls do you think we'll see? I think, yeah, I think it's gonna be a massive test. I think they're a very proud team, proud, proud nation as a whole. So I don't think, I think you come away here to South and you get a victory. I think you've, you've done really well. So I think, yeah, it's gonna be a massive, massive test for us and. and yeah, I think one we're all looking forward to. We were joking about it in the airport, but you pinch yourself how far but this club has come. You, you a wet night at Newport for your debut, and now you're 30 degrees in, in South Africa. Yeah, it is mad to think how, how it's all changed. And yeah, it's exciting for rugby. It's exciting yeah, for the future. And yeah, we, yeah, it is, it is crazy to think that actually. But um, yeah, looking forward to it.